Welcome to the second video in the Ranarex Studio Recorder series. In the previous video, you saw how to create a new test solution and configured whitelisting to focus just on the Ranarex demo app. In this video, you will learn how to create a basic recording with a validation step using the Ranarex demo app as the application under test. In the file view, click the Add Recording Module button. The name of the recording defaults to Recording 2. Let's change this to Add Entry. Click Create. Click Record. Ranarex Studio minimizes to the taskbar and the Ranarex Demo app appears, as well as the Recorder Control Center. The Recorder Control Center has both a full and a minimized view. You can use the arrow in the top right corner to switch between views. Use the pause button in the recorder controls to temporarily pause recording if necessary or click stop to immediately stop recording. In the demo app, click the test database tab. Click on the first name field and enter Sally space Anne. Click in the last name field and enter Doe. Click the drop down arrow in the department field and choose Development. Click in the age field, backspace to delete the zero, and enter 25. Click Female. Click Add Entry. In the recorder controls, you see a history of the actions that you have recorded. Mouse over the eye icon to see the screenshot that was captured for each action. You can use the trash can to delete an action. Click the Add button to choose one of three types of actions to add manually. You can add a message to appear in the test runner port, take a screenshot, or add a delay for a number of seconds. Let's add a message for the test run report to indicate that a validation is being performed. Now, click Validate and then click on the Number of Entries text field. The validation dialog appears. Notice that the values for Enabled, Valid, and Visible are all set to True. Click Next. Ensure that Exists and Text are both checked and then click OK. Now, let's delete the record that we just added. Finally, click Stop to stop the recording. Ranarex Studio is restored from the taskbar and the actions that you captured appear in the Action Editor. Click on each action to observe its corresponding item in the object repository and the screenshot that was captured during recording. To learn more about the relationship between the Action Editor and the repository, Watch the fourth video in the Ranarex Studio Quick Start series, which is linked in the video description. Watch the next video in this series to learn how to edit your recorded actions.